Welcome to Odoo Essentials. Leading a company has never been easy, but now with the increased competition, it's harder than ever, and a company really needs to stand out in order to thrive. Having a website is one of the first ways to achieve that, and if you use the right tools, it could only take a few minutes to build one. My name is Amy Caroline, and in this series of videos, I'm going to be the owner of a two-person company selling handmade furniture. My company deals with visibility issues and we lose sales because of that. I want to create a website so that I can solve this problem and gain new customers. So in this video, I'm going to build one from scratch. And of course, I would like to personalize it to my company's aesthetic and be sure that my visitors can navigate the pages with ease. So let's see how Odoo can help me create a well-organized and beautiful website right now. All right, so once we're on our Odoo dashboard, let's go ahead and enter our website application and then go to our website so we can start building it right away. So then we'll go to Customize and Customize Theme. Now the theme will really be the uh, foundation of our design, so this is really important. I haven't installed one yet, so I need to do that by either clicking on this button or I can go to the settings of my website application. But I'll click on this for now. And it will lead me to uh, several theme options, okay? So, of course, these all have different aesthetics. So, I need to pick the one that best fits um, my company. And um, I have different functionalities with different themes. Of course, maybe my uh, logo will be placed differently in one theme than it would in another. So, I want to be sure I check all of these out and find the best one. I can even have a live preview of the different themes so I can um, fully grasp the full uh, range and all of the functionalities that it has to offer. Uh, but for now, I really like this first one, Graphene. I think that that will look really good for my company. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on this button, Use Theme. And it will take just a moment to load. And once it's loaded, it will refresh my page and redirect me um, to the home page of my site so that I can start building it and customizing it right away. So let's go back to Customize, Customize Theme. Now, since we have the theme installed, we have some other options. So I can choose my main colors. So I'm going to go ahead and choose this kind of um, greenish color here because I think that that will look really great uh, with my products. Okay, I have secondary colors, extra colors, background colors, and more. Um, but I'll leave that the way it is for right now. Um, I can also change the layout of my homepage and I can also add some fonts. Um, so I really like Sinzel. So I'm gonna add that for almost everything. But of course I can have different fonts for my body or the button or the title. Um, whatever I choose so I can really customize it to my preferences okay now we'll exit this um, and we're going to really uh, start putting the content into our website onto the home page okay so let's click on this edit button I'm gonna add some building blocks so that I can really structure my homepage the way that I want. Um, and I really want to entice new customers with this homepage. I want my customers to be excited about my products because I really think that this will be the thing to increase my sales, which I desperately need, okay? So let's start with a cover. And so there's a photo already added. Of course, I'll change that so that it fits my um, company's aesthetic, but it does give me a good idea of all the possibilities. So I like that a lot. Then I'll add a title here. Then let's do a banner text, okay. Um, then three columns. All right, it's been 20 or 30 seconds and it's already looking really good. Of course, I need to add my own content, but I really like what I see so far. Okay, and I also would like to add quotes. So you have a lot of different block options, so you really have a lot of flexibility with how you can organize your page here. So be sure you check out all of these things because it's really cool. And um, this quote one is really important for my company because I want to be sure that my new customers or my future customers um, will see the testimonies of those customers that I already have uh, because I think that will really... Um, Make me stand out of the crowd. All right, so now that I have the organization the way that I would like, let's go ahead and start customizing this a little bit. So the first thing I'm gonna do is add a different background photo for um, my cover block, because that will be the first thing that my customers see or the people who are visiting my website. So I'm gonna click on Customize here. 
So I have some different options. Um, so I can explore all of these. Um, but for now, I'm going to add a background image simply. Okay. So I can upload an image, I can add an image URL, or I can also add an image that's an unsplash, which is what I'm going to do right now because that's a really convenient feature. All right, I'm just going to search for um, furniture because I sell, of course, handmade furniture, as you already know. So I want to choose a photo that really represents my company well. So I like this one right here. So I'm going to select this and click on save. All right. That applies right away. Now, I don't actually want a headline. I just want to add my logo. So I'm going to remove this. And then I'm going to go to this little image icon at the top. And now I'm going to upload my logo. All right. So I'll go ahead, select that, click on open. All right. That looks really good so far. I'm really happy about this. OK. Now I'm going to, of course, add some text here, bringing a layer of mystery to furniture. Okay, so let's do a couple of other things as well. Um, so of course, as you have seen, we can um, edit text. We have a lot of options up here. So you can edit the size, bold, italic, um, change the color. You can even add a hyperlink if you need to. All right, so that's really cool. Um, and we also have some other really neat options that I'm gonna show you right now. Um, so first, let me add some um, titles to these columns. So I'm gonna say my products are eco-friendly. All right, I have uh, custom products. And I also have unique designs. Okay, now out of these three, I really want to draw the eye to one in particular. So something I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna click on this image and I wanna animate it a little bit just so my customers really focus on this. Even though all three are important, I am the most proud of my custom products. So I'm gonna click on customize again and animate. Okay, so we have a bunch of options here. So of course I want to draw some attention to this. So I'm gonna choose my attention seekers. And you can see immediately as I go over these, it kind of previews what will happen. But let's choose shake, I really like that. Um, so I want my customers to be scrolling down, they'll see this and it'll just start shaking and they'll say, ooh, I'm gonna pay attention to that. All right, so of course I have more um, animation options. I can ch change the duration, I can add a delay, um, and then I have some extended options here. So I can say that each time it becomes visible, it shakes. Okay, um, so let's go back to this customize, um, these, these customized options. Okay, so we can change some background effects, um, some background color from here. Um, you can also change the amount of columns that you have. So maybe I want five instead of the three. So you really have a ton of options, a ton of flexibility. Um, so from here, I don't really like the, the five columns. So I'm going to go ahead and change that back to three because I think that looks better. Um, I really have a lot of options to give my homepage something special. Um, but for now, I really like what I've done so far. So I'm going to click on save and just see what this will look like. All right. So when it has saved, has saved, I get the visitor view, okay? Um, so I can check out everything, and of course it's shaking, all right? I can even see all of the um, customer quotes or their testimonies right here. Um, so that's all for this video, but I do have more customizing to do for my website, so be sure you check out the other videos as well, and thank you for watching.